and they just did two intros and heck on. So this will be the one. The one. So um so if you can hear some noise my I'm right in front of my dryer and my what my dryer and my washing machine and my dogs are running around like crazy. So um yeah so I have to speak really loud so um <coughs> So um, the whole reason that I'm going to do this series called Quick Fake Bake is because um, my mummy got me this um, Christmas tree thing. It got white spots, but you can't see it very well. It's all like green, except for the back and the inside. I thought it's plenty of space for making cookies, so I'm gonna make cookies today. So the ingredients what you'll need is flour. I use this flour for stuff. It, it is from Tesco, and it's called plain flour. And it's plain flour. Uh, flour and then we have dark chocolate you can use Nutella you can use any chocolate but I'm just using this one because I'm allergic to milk I'm allergic I get rations lots of stuff so that's why I'm using dark chocolate so um if you've been wondering um if you don't oops, if you don't know that um well, keep on doing the one sentence. Let me just go up. I have up chairs and spinny chairs. I love them. So, um, so, um, I'm just going to be starting now. So, you'll need a baking bowl. But if you don't have a baking bowl, like I know, I'll just use a sauce. And also, what you need is. Two hundred and the water in the measuring cup. Also, you'll need um, a tea. Uh, I think it's like a quarter of a spoon or teaspoon of quarter spoon or teaspoon of sugar. I've no idea to put my sugar. I'm just gonna put just gonna get it in the video. Yeah. So I got my um sauce pan here. So first I'm gonna um put a lot of powder in. So um, I'm not measuring this and just put rubbing it in so so let's just do this though, you just have to pour in like a couple, like so. one you'll need a spoon. So um, there you go, you'll need that, lots of power, plenty in there, plenty of power. I don't know why I'm mixing it now but I just want to. I love flour, it's nice and soft, it's lovely to play with. <laughs> so um, <coughs> now it's time to pouring the chocolate. Now, you will need a lot of chocolate because you're making chocolate cookies. So, so you have to, um, so you have to like get lots and lots and lots and lots of chocolate. Just tipping it in there. You could use the metallic ball. I'm not. I'm just going to tip it all in there. Just tip, 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 tip. So I'm just going to tip it all in there. About three spoonfuls. If you need some more, you can just get some more later. Or if you just need to mix it up and then brown, you definitely need more. If I mix it up, I definitely need more. Some more, 
also this might take a while for you to get all of your powder all of your powder like chocolate but uh, it just depends on how many cookies you want so I'm just gonna chuck it all in but don't use all of your chocolate I suggest getting a brand new bit of Magella or because uh, there's a lot, there's a big amount of it right there so um yeah so when you think it's enough you have to put it on but remember you can always just put some more my spoon is so chocolatey so you can always get some more the most thicker it gets the most better it is so you need a lot a lot a lot a lot a lot So it looks like it has chocolate chips in. So there it is. Next, next up, you're going to pour in the. Next up, you're going to pour in the tw <laughs> two hundred. Um, well, it's not Gary's leg. Um, of your measuring cup. So I'm just gonna pull it in. Just to mix it up. If you need more um, powder like I do, you can just get some more. So I'm just gonna get some more. A lot of powder. There we go. So there we go. And Mix it up. Oh, I need a lot more powder. It's sticky and stuff. Yeah, so you have to put a lot of powder in. Like about a whole cup or something. I don't know, a lot. So I need to be careful now because this is all the way up. Top. Better. I'm gonna get. Oops. I'm gonna get um. Another spoon great stuff. So get another spoon, guys. When you're making your cookies or your fake break cookies, because you will need it. Cause look at my spoon. Just needs to break all of that off. Look at all of that chocolate. Needs to break all of that off. Uh. And you can get some baking materials. So I need more chocolate. Well, it's not going to taste like chocolate, but we've got to eat it. It's not going to taste like chocolate. If it, you can't see like any chocolate, you have to get lots. Sorry about that. If you can't see any chocolate, um, you have to get lots more. I have to feel like a little bit. That's told you that you're okay. But I can't then. I need to. So, um. In my next video, tell me in the comments. Um. Well, in this video, tell me in the comments. Um. What food should I do next? normal things not like a wedding cake can't freeze a wedding cake can't you so there we go all chocolate it looks like chocolate chips in it really thick sticking onto a spoon <laughs> it's amazing so that's enough for mixing for now so um now I'm gonna get my teeth or my quarter spoon or my teaspoon just that spoon I don't know what it's called just that type of spoon get your sugar twist 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 look how many sugar we have so we get our sugar 
a lid somewhere and get some sugar. Like a full spoon. That, like overflowing. And one more. So I'm going to have two spoonfuls. It's going to be really chopped. Cheeky, but I, of course I'm not going to be eating these. Because I like being healthy, guys. I like being healthy. Even though I eat crisp, I like being healthy. A lot of crisp every day. I like being healthy. I'm going to change my spoon. So you will need to change your spoon once in a while. Because this is like... Powder goes everywhere. <laughs> so, because this is like so hard to do. Look at that chocolate stuff. Uh, I told you this is going to be sweet. So you have to mix it, mix it, mix it, mix it, mix all of them lumps out. But this is going to be really hard because in a minute you have to grind your hands into it. So I do recommend gloves, gloves, or or if you want to have some fun like I'm going to be, use your bare hands, people. So um, when it's all mixed in, you have to mix it all a little bit more times. You pull your sleeves up, or you get gloves. Time for the time. And if you're doing it with your bare hands, I recommend getting a little tea towel or towel. Hey guys, it's going to get sticky. I mean, really sticky. So one, two, three, go. Oh, feel it all. Grind, grind. So you have to do this for a while because you can feel all the lumps in here. And it's so fun. <laughs> If you like me, I love doing it with my bare hands. But you can, if you don't like putting your hands in gooey stuff, just get some gloves. But if you don't want to do it like this, get a mixing tool because it will stick onto your gloves. But it's fun doing it with your bare hands. It's really sticky though, and it's really and it feels like a mixer, but it's really lumpy because you put in all of that powder and that sugar. It's going to be really lump, lumpy, and you can and I'm doing this without parents' help, but you need parents' permission. But I'm doing this without parents' help, so it's actually a kid thing. Because I'm only eight years old. See all of that, that's a big lump. It's like grind, grind, grind. But um, I would say you have to be over the age about five. Because to do it on your own. Because. Because there's a lot of stuff what you have to do in this. And I always say, ask the parents to get all of the stuff out for you. Because you can't just get that stuff out yourself. You might, if it's too high in the cupboard, you might get a chair and try and climb up. No. Ask the parent to help. Woo! like soap <laughs> after your hands are so sticky it's at least after about like um, five minutes you can get out your hands and you can get your towel and you can rub them it might take a little long to get out so I would recommend get a long tea towel or towel Grown ups, you're in bad luck. <laughs> so, um, 
so um so um if you want to have a sticky mess don't have gloves and if you don't want to um get gloves because it's so sticky and you will drop it down so so yeah so i have it all over here it's not very good and the table not very good and on the laptop really not good so um i have a chocolate laptop now so um yeah so um, after you washed all of it out um start from mixing again make sure it's all easy to mix before like that and see how good it flows you can do lots of stuff but remember you have to do just like me a lot of powder just really a lot so um once you've done that and it looks like diarrhea so go back to the one where it started and it's all white and go back to here and it's this colour, diarrhea colour, diarrhea all over the place. Ah! It's not actually diarrhea. I'm not making diarrhea people. I'm making chocolate cookies but it looks like diarrhea. Once um, we make, um, we're trying to make purple purple I was trying to make purple in play-doh and um, it turned out a diarrhea shape thing so that was really good I recommend if I recommend don't do it in your really expensive clothes it will be get messy so that's all you have to do but you don't just leave them in the fridge in the saucepan. I'm just gonna cook something in the fridge. I'm just gonna cook something in the fridge. No, 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 no. You have to get a plate or a cookie sheet. And if you have stuff on it, take them all off. Because you can't have stuff on it. And you're getting your cookies. Illegal, the cookie, the baking thing. Okay, okay. Um, in the baking, fake, quick bake, fake walls. Ooh, fat, ooh, ooh, ooh. That is disgusting. Absolutely disgusting. I do have to put my laptop in here, so <laughs> I'm just getting this tissue. Right. So um, here it is. Here's my thing. So um, I wish I had some cookie cookies. So um, now you just have to get your baking bowl. Ew. Get your baking bowl. Put it somewhere. I'm running out of room. I need to get some of this big towel to wipe me. Ugh. Ugh. Disgusting. Disgusting. So, <laughs> you have to get your stuff, the diarrhea, cookie stuff. You have to put it on. Get some more. Put it on the sheet. Get some more. Put it on the sheet. Get some more. Put it on the sheet. Get some more.
some more. Put it on the sheet. So I put one, two, three, four, five, and I have still stuff left. So I'm gonna put these for my tester. I unfortunately have to be my mom. <laughs> So um, so um, so um, that's how you quick bake fake. So um, unfortunately, um, you have to do it with not like these kind type of chairs. <laughs> so um. And I have to use all of this one day. So, um, got all of that. Put it right here. Wait for chair. My face is never going to come out in it. <laughs> so, I recommend you do it on wooden chairs or stuff like that. So that's the end of my video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And bye. I got powder on my laptop.